But everybody it's been over back with the uh, middle part and the dragos. Uh, fangs and dragos, blah. My my brain. I didn't I know that I made a twin myself, but day twenty four of uh, co op season two. <laughs> Kinda just come back overnight from moving more stuff around, so and uh literally out of gas there. Thankfully there's more gas in the chest, so just kinda just quickly dropping more stuff off to get through a little bit and Fangs, you want me to make another trip over to uh, help move some stuff or that's up to you or you I'm... could start doing some missions or they or try and get the I know a lot or make the base uh, empty of furniture and then also making sure the walls are repaired yeah. Um... Although you, you might want to come back with and make a uh, claim station, then pick up some of the materials from our base, as well as grabbing. If you would, then start. Uh, please them. start up the start the forge and empty it that out. All right, I'll get that going because I know yeah. how much that's gonna take. It won't take too long. It's just that I would like to not wait for a forge. Oh no, it takes an incredibly long time if it's a high A amount. Yeah, we'll be fine. What can I do to be useful? Keep chopping trees. Yes, please, keep okay. chopping trees. Basically, Fangs and Mrs. Drag up and we're gonna chopping trees all night. So. Screamer! How lovely. Nice to see that you guys have company over there. You're not lonely. Eh, not like I was lonely in the first place. <laughs> Well, now you have even, uh, now you're even more not lonely. Clay, take as much as I can, which is 22, then iron. All in all, taking about 35 minutes or so. Ah. As I said, it'll take a while. I am. That was not even a full stack of anything. I at least it'll take down time for me at least when since I'm traveling all the way over with the mini bike. Boy, I'm getting a little yeah. s sick of the putt putt machine. <laughs> Do you want me to another keep screamer? All the, all the pine seeds and then getting that. things getting free streamer to see. Yeah, do that. It's not what I want since I'm trying to harvest wood. Well, the Screamer thought you needed some XP fangs. I mean, touche. <laughs> I remember seeing someone actually, like, uh, was like, hmm, maybe you should actually try making a, a loot farm base out of this, utilizing Screamers. I mean, I've, al I've already thought of something to do the same. Yeah. Not hard. You just gotta do what I did in Season 1 at the end. Um, but they were they were kind of talking about like you know like how they wish they could do like kind of like the old uh, Minecraft uh, mob farm style, like where you get them down to one end and then you basically just farm the XP. Or I was thinking like how yeah, you could do it. like if only you could do like the dropper style base. Hi, Mr. Bear, just casually roaming the streets. Mr. Bear lives room in the streets. Ow, I crashed into a shopping cart. Way to go! I didn't know you were a terrible driver. <laughs> I'm not this bad in real life. Are you sure about that, sir? I'd be a pretty good driver in real life. Um, oh, I hear you. I just went right past you. By the nice. way, um, Drago, watch out for Tony for Tony. Oh, yes. Big Tony. Yes. Cause I'll make you, sure I got some if, calzones on hand. I was gonna say if you if you don't if you if you don't be quiet, he'll you'll hear that you have uh, two for ones on calzones. <laughs> I'm uh, not gonna try and understand the insider joke that I just heard. Oh, it's the big it's the big dude in the Hawaiian shirt. Stove, one of my viewers, uh, he he renamed him to uh, well, he suggested the name of I think like. Joey Fatoni, but I couldn't remember at the time, so I decided to call him Tony Fatoni. 
because he's so fat. And uh, so it's like, because it, it's like, you know, the name's like, uh, kind of like uh, a little bit Italian inspired, I I would say, you know. Yeah, he's an Italian mafia guy. Totally he, he loves his calzones. <laughs> So yeah, the big tourist guy is now um, being referred to as Tony, or Tony Fatoni. Yeah, um, did fine. Did, you know, I'm actually kind of cruising by uh, Trader Joel's, so, so he is about to restock tomorrow. Unfortunately, I don't have any. Don't have any. Um, uh, mula. Yeah, mula. So, unfortunately, old Trader Joel here is not going to be. They get any of my patronage today. <laughs> I'm sure you can live without it. <laughs> Meanwhile, you just get just just cut just do like a random ass cut over to when like he's got when he's got like a whole horde of zombies swarming him because I didn't pay him for like the treasure hunter mod. Mm -hmm. uh, give us give me a second. We'll be back over to the old days, guys. Everybody, I've pulled up to the base once again. <laughs> I know this is just like basically moving simulator, but it kind of has to be done. So um, I might be on tree chopping duty as I just casually drive by a deer. Oh, a zombie! The zombie just be entering in the forest, and it gets a 44 magnum randomly, or a nine mil. No, it's an arrow. Oh. Straight to the balls. <laughs> Not on purpose, man. It just thanks, the arrow drop. Thanks, man. you're torturing the zombies. That, the <laughs> next year, the zombie Geneva Convention is gonna come over and uh, and have a word with you about it. Yeah, I'll I'll handle them the same way I did with that zombie. I know what you're thinking. Geneva Convention is more like Geneva suggestions. Yep, the clown with flesh gloves. <laughs> uh, I mean, that's his actual lore, so. Uh, okay. I'm about uh, to probably watch you just ch ching 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 in tree fall, tree fall, tree fall. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Like, uh, well, I can't quite one shot it with that fire axe. But if I had a steel fire axe, that would be a well, steel axe. Or... Thing. Right. I've repaired it twice, Ace. You know. So, oh, oh su you're sweet. welcome. Thank you. Let's see how fast I chop this up. Uh, not that quick, unfortunately. What were you doing for damage before? Uh, under 100. I am doing... Over 100. Mm -hmm. And I'm getting like 150 wood per tree, so... Not bad. Not me chopping with the stone axe now. 
Yeah, this is Dragon Ball like, Shadow a lot, so. Uh, give us a second. Are oh, you just gonna shadow. undermine me, man? What? I've been shopping too! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you. I mentioned to you that you were shopping all night earlier. Don't you worry. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of trees here. I'm just annoyed with this uh, unbreakable tree. Yeah, there's one. At least, at least there's, at least there's not like, uh, at least, it, at least it can't follow us. Now, if, now if we, can we find another unbreakable tree at our next base, I'm gonna think it's a <laughs> curse. <laughs> <laughs> well, think about it this way: at least there's not, uh, at least there's not like invulnerable zombies. I don't think of that one. Was, I'd it. But then we'd have to constantly repair the blocks. <laughs> as long as you have multiple steel blocks, you can make it where it works for a long time. How many trees did I plant again? Uh, you planted roughly three, four hundred and I than I planted in our hundreds, so I think we planted around 500 in total. But I meant on this last planting spree, I thought it planted like over 100. Yeah, I know. I We planted around 500 total. Hey look, zombies! Come here, you little assholes! Oh! Screamers! Radiant screamer! And one! Mr. Echo. Guys, we're getting a watery horde! Woohoo! There's a Drake water horde and screamers. I'll take care of him. Mikey, good to see you, buddy. Businessman, big mama. So, oh, Drago's, <laughs> the, Mrs. Drago's done. That's why I told you to run, miss. Come here, guys. I, I will run, Mrs. Drago. Yeah, this is not radiated. Free haircuts for the zombies. Come here, guys. Yeah, they're... And I see a couple more water Why are they breaking the tree? Tony, good to see you. Yeah, they do that they're... randomly. They're my trees. <laughs> I would have found it even more ironic if it's the, uh, if it's a lumberjack. Come here. Who's the radiated woman? There we go, slice his head off just for good measure. This one. I I sliced your <laughs> arm off. <laughs> no, you sliced her. You you literally vaporized her all but her arm. <laughs> eh, she doesn't need that arm anymore. I thought it was I thought I was climbing the tree for a second. Huh. Oh well. Guys, we'll be back a little bit. Like hopefully back at the, the new house.
Alrighty, everybody, so gonna wind up fast working through those trees, but finally got everything harvested up for the most part, I believe. Yep. yep. Looking pretty clear over here. It looks so odd. <laughs> it used to be one big forest, now it's all deforested. Yep, and I'm out of uh, hunger. I'm starving. Red, red flash and light. Yeah. I was going to say, though, because we clear out all these trees, Lorax is going to be chasing after our asses. Who cares about the Lorax? It'd be funny if there was, like, a zombie Lorax. Alright, uh... The... Here's something that we forgot. What do we forget? For the... Smelter. Oh, lovely! I'm just currently chowing down some steak in the in front of the campfire. And I'm doing the same from the other one. Although, it's grilled meat, not steak, sir. <laughs> eh, in the zombie apocalypse, it might as well be steaks. Oh, I yeah, mean, they're... it's not from a cow. Most of this is from a bear. Bear steaks? Um, uh, grab this weapon. Although bear meat is actually incredibly unhealthy. Really? Did not know that. Yeah, it ha it often has a, uh, for most bears, just they they have so many worms crawling through their flesh. Makes sense. Um, uh, Vangs, I'm gonna read through most of these books that are, just so like we don't have to worry about space from those. All right. Get that. Oh, Fangs, I'm sure you'll be happy and be aware of this. I unlocked Stone Sledgehammer Quality 4. I don't use a sledgehammer. I'm just saying, like, for... You know, like... I'm like, oh, whenever I see those kind of low-level unlocks, because, like, I'm not expecting to that, I'm like, oh, lovely, I, I've unlocked this pretty tool that I'm not going to use. Uh, Fangs? Yeah... Bad news. We're what? not able to take the take the workbench with because it's we missing. Are. No, I'm saying because it's missing two hit points. I'm not kidding. Yeah, not too hard to repair. Um, grab the grilled meat. I'll take. You must have gotten some car parts as you were. Yeah. The thing is, we'll need a forged iron. That's not my concern. Uh, my concern is, where is it? Just throw everything in. So... Yeah. I'm making a land claim block so we can actually pick this stuff up. Oh yeah, let's actually make sure we take the concrete with. Uh, do we already have a land claim block down? No, I think it's because of my bed. Try it now. Oh yeah. Nope. Weird. Is there a bed up? Might be because of dragons. There's two beds. Uh, are I, you guys fine if I? Are you guys I threw my I... land claim block underneath when I, like, underneath the base. Oh. Oh, that's why then. Great. Oh, if it's already down, then I can just pick it up since we're allied. Just should be able to. Um. It won't let me pick up the cement mixtures. Yeah, so I'll have to break it then. Where is the? Yeah, where where is this? Where below? Just out of the stairs. Under the stairs. Under the stairs. I see... Oh, I see it over here. Break it. I'm doing damage to it, yet it's making the sound as invulnerable. That is... Oh yeah, because we're in the same... Oh, oh I'm doing damage. I was about to say. Okay, give us a second, we'll kind of... 
get three laps. Seven thousand HP. There you go, guys. Okay, thankfully Mrs. Drago's nearby, and so I asked her to help destroy by just picking up that land claim block. I think she'll be able to place that now. Yep, grabbing the cement mixer. Yep, grab the cement mixers and. We said the money was already take, taken out? Yep, okay. Hmm. That's one. Because we gotta... It takes we... 15 seconds. Yeah, I know. Oh yeah, thanks. Don't forget your little, uh... Don't forget your robo... Your little robo-sledge if you haven't picked it up. I know. Come here, little dude. Yeah, I got a, I got a little idea how I could repair that quick. Uh, give me a couple of just random stuffs and yeah, crap! <coughs> I got the stupid dirt armor on. So I have to make it five kilometers away. Five kilometers away, correct, Amendo. Five point one, but yeah, it's gonna take you a while. That it is. It will I be sprint. honestly feel bad for how long it's gonna take. If I had a if I had a uh, vehicle seating mod on my mini bike, I would let you ride with me, Get Mrs. Drago. Um, I have a bike that I left there. You hungry or something? She could use that. I have a bike as well, but it's gonna take forever. So that, so that, so that. It's fine. I'll collect stuff as I go. Oh no, you're gonna need a bike. It's that far. Come here. Uh, okay, I'll come back. Let's see. I I could have bought her a a bicycle no for six Being grand. But... Now beat it. There Fuck we are. Up. Now let me unlock it. Unlock. There we are. Thank you. And unfortunately, gonna have to get something to. It goes where you look, unless you get R three. Okay. So, um, do I have a wrench on me? No, I don't. I'll check the. Oh, you can look at your inventory while biking? Yes. Yep. They changed cool. that, thankfully. Um, so where you do we. You said you have a wrench, right? No, I don't. Okay. So we're gonna have to get a mechanical part and a forged iron. So that's that sucks. I mean, because the Forge Giant I could probably just get for Trigger Rick really quick if he's not going to be absolutely useless. How much cash you got? Um, he's. What's it gonna I've be, got 288 huh? bucks. I can buy. Oh, you want a guarantee? Huh? I got the Forge well, Iron needed. I just need a mechanical right. part now. So, yeah, guys, uh, quite a little bit of a blunder here. So, um, let's kind of tune in with you if we get a mechanical part. One way to look at it. Aha! Found mechanical parts! Nice. I, I decided to go back to a like guys I found mechanical parts I decided to go back to a, to the pass of gas I originally kind of looked for mechanical parts at like however many weeks ago in in game and it's like and uh, so happy days I could we can take the workbench with this is a good, good find S stroke has stroke of luck Oh, happy days. I mean, there should already be a forge at the other base, because I had one crafted, I just never placed it down. Mmm, yeah. But then again, the extra forge would be very helpful, just for, like, if we want to dedicate that to some melting stone. <laughs> um, well, let me just get that workbench repaired, and... Oh, Screamer! Hi! Yep, the... 
that is repaired for you. Yeah, you have to pick it up. You just found yep. a wrench. So. And... Oh, hi! The Jolly Ranchers have showed up. Bye. You get your head cut off. You found a wrench? Right picking up the oh. horse bench. Tell you what, Fangs, if you if you want to wait for the for the iron to smelt, uh, I can go over to the new house. And... Come here, guys. Lots of screamers. Mikey the Jolly Ranchers here too. Yeah, it'll take 20 minutes. But, uh... Uh... I'm glad that you uh, all of you have attend. Ow! Ow! Almost got surrounded by zombies. Splendid. Take care of you. Run. Ow. Get away from me, clowns. Make sure you're shot. And... I think we're gonna mobile stone with all these zombies. There. Since you guys decided to be party poopers. How much space you got left in your inventory? Uh, like, t like a bar and a half of inventory. What do you mean, and a half? Oh, you mean an actual row? Yeah. Uh. Hang on, let me clear out one more inventory space by. By throwing some pipe bombs at the at Tony. Did you fill up your car as well with items? Yeah, my hot bar is basically full. I was meaning your car. Oh yeah, I did. All right, I'm gonna give you some things to take over. Yep, let me just take care of Tony here, since he decided to eat two pipe bombs. All right, collecting the dew collectors. <clears throat> Yeah, I can take the dew collectors if you want me to. Um, annoying thing is that mo the mods don't stack. Yeah, that is annoying. Uh, Dragos, did you want us to bring the stuff that was in your box in the uh, in your little apartment, or are you good without that stuff? Uh, you can actually grab if something if you need it. Otherwise, um. We'll end up back there one time and grab it. Yeah, there's not there's not too much there, so like I'll try to take some stuff, but not too much. Cause I try to take enough. All right, I put all the dew collectors there in, there in there and the uh, mods for them. Try and grab as much as you can from the mods and stuff. Okay. Um. Hang on, I can actually clear out a little bit more space in my inventory because some of it is books. There we go, double barreled shotgun. Is it in the food stuff box or? Nope, duct tape. Duct tape. I am able to take all of it. I still have room for a little bit more. Uh. If you want, you can look through my mods thing, my mods bin, if you want to take any of that. Mods bin, where is that? Oh, I, uh, no, that's meds. Uh, which one's your mods box? Oh no, wait a minute, I found it next to, next to meds. Hello. <laughs> Gonna drop a couple useless items, I think. And... Alright, I've taken most of the mod stuff out. Some of those are just oak seeds and plant fibers and a stun baton part. Uh -huh. Okay. So guys, I'm going to end this episode here. We're going to kind of travel overnight and we should be kind of officially in the winter biome now because I think we've moved pretty much everything out. So I'm going to leave this episode here. If you made this far and you like what you see, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below. It helps the channel out oh so much. I hope you have a good one, and take care.